networking event. I'm here with none other than the president of IEIA, Mr. K.V. Nagendra Prasad. And we're going to speak to him about the roadshow and how important are these roadshows for the industry. So, sir, thank you so much for giving us your precious time. This is the very first time that IEIA roadshow like this has happened. Uh, why after such a long time and why is it only the first time here in Bombay? We started this about a year back where uh, we or rather two years back you know uh, where we are conducting road shows across the country we have done it in hyderabad as well initially so the idea is to move closer to our uh, our fraternity uh, members non-members uh, to listen to them uh, to share our ideas you know and to network and basically build the organization the association uh, that is the idea how important do you think are these kind of road shows and uh, networking events uh, for the industry See, as IEIA, we interact with our uh, fraternity once in a year through the open seminar. Uh, of course, offline through on our exhibit magazine and emailers and all that. But uh, direct contact is only once in a year. So these kind of networking events, we believe, will help us, you know, understand more of our uh, fraternity's requirements. Specifically, coming to places like Bombay or Hyderabad, Bangalore, Delhi. We can look at local issues if the industry here is facing any local issue and whether the uh, you know, association can collectively address those. Uh, it is important in uh, that way and also to basically you know, network more with our fraternity, be close to them, understand issues, address them and grow the organization. Uh, so we have quite a few members of IEIA in Bombay. So why is it only now that you have uh, come to Bombay? We have been coming here. The, we had uh, three years back the open seminar was in Bombay. So Bombay is a very integral part of the association. So this is a routine activity that way if you look at. Uh, we are going to all the major metros in uh, India and now it is turn of uh, Bombay. That's it. And how often uh, do you think are you going to have these uh, events, uh, roadshows and uh, networking events? See, the idea is internally that every fourth EC meeting we want to have it in a different location. IEIA is the, is the industry association. So when you get uh, inquiries or issues from other companies, from organizers and all, how does IEIA take that into consideration and what, how do they help the organizers to solve all what, whatever kind of issues and what are the major issues that you usually come across? It is a common uh, issue generally nowadays that we are hearing about. Uh, entertainment tax in the city or number of permissions required to host exhibitions. Uh, Bombay and Delhi particularly have this uh, problem. So as an association, we have been trying to you know, address this. We have met concerned ministers, secretaries, the government officials in this regard, and a lot of representations have gone in. And there is also commitments from the government side also that this would be sorted out. And in Delhi we, and Bombay, we have now uh, a single point uh, you know, um, where we could get all the clearances done. I would not attribute it to our uh, achievement alone. Uh, collectively, other event associations, everybody has worked on it. So everybody put f their pressure and this could be achieved. So there are issues like that. So where is the next road show now? Uh, we have to see, uh, the again, the EC will meet. We'll find a location where, uh, you know, the best possible place to conduct it. And we'll do it there. So you have not planned out any of this? You're just randomly choosing a city? We are rotating it one after the other, uh, so next location we have to, the EC has to decide. So how is your CEM program going on? Uh, it is going on very well actually. Last year uh, almost 33 people passed out from India from the very first batch. And this year we have so far about 23 registrations and we are likely to fill the batch of 30 people required to do the uh, CEM program. Uh, the faculty is on their way and the program is all set and we'll be rolling it out in the first week of October. So the next batch will be graduating in uh, next year for MICE or in the open seminar? It will be in March actually. Thank you so much sir for your time. You have a very nice day and nice flight back home. So that was Mr. K.V. Nagandra Prasad, the president of IEIA, talking to us about the roadshow and the importance of the roadshows in for the industry. Thank you so much for watching Trade Fed TV. I'm your host Meghna signing off for the day.